So, ferrous cerium rods then. There's a load on the market. These are my new favorite. This is from Forest Fundamentals, all right? This is called the High Fire Starter because it is hexagonal. Check that out. Loads of surface area to strike on. Six inches, proper six inches, gents. None of that, like it, six inches, maybe, like if it's warm. Um, super duper amazing. I've not been this impressed by six inches since I looked in my mum's top drawer when I was 12. Boom, never been the same again. Um, we've got this one, so there, the Hive. We've got the Artisan, um, lovely wooden handle there with some fat wood. We're gonna get into that as well. Tinder and strike stick, can't lose it, even I'll not get it wrong. Um, then we've got the Stealth. Um, stealth, not sure what makes it stealthy. Maybe you can't find it when you need it, I, I don't know. Um, but with a little bit of waxed rope there, ideal for getting a match. It's like a, a never ending match ideal and it all fits together. The guys have really, really thought about this. Um, and I'm gonna let you into a secret that I don't even think they've worked out yet. Um, so yeah, that, and then we've got the Sidekick. Um, lovely magnetized clips there so you don't choke yourself to death. Um, ferro rod there and a little striker. Now let's see how they all work because that's what we're really here for. So starting off with the Artisan then, we've got lovely turned beach handle. Use it with gloves, really, really chunky. Three inch long and mega thick. It's about as thick as a Sharpie there. You can see that, that is boop, 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 boop. Um, Yeah, chunky and thick, nice one. Um, sparks that it produces using its very own striker. I mean, that's easy. I'm not even putting any pressure on that. Boom. And the fat wood that it comes with, if I get the knife and just give it a little crank into there and get a load of shavings. Let's see if the actual ferro rod itself is gonna get it lit. So ferro rod with the own with its striker. Oh yeah. Check that out burning nice and bright, all that lovely smoke that's coming off there. Lovely. Next up, the Stealth Fire Starter, the waxed jute rope with the same fire steel as the Artisan. Um, exactly the same striker, so I imagine that they're pretty much, in fact, I know for a fact, I know for a fact that they work just as well. Um, the Stealth Fire Starter then, it's got this little well in here just there, which the ferro rod sits in. If you can get this. Now, I love the way they've put the paracord on, but it doesn't have to get in the way sometimes. Um, I'd for sure cut that paracord off um, and, and just tie it to a bag or something. It's just, for me, it just gets in the way. However, everybody's different, I get that. Scruff up the end of the jute wax cord and let's see if we can get that lit I mean look at that and then you've got yourself a cheeky little match let it burn away let it catch a light and then at the end just pull it and it'll extinguish it all out just push it back through, ready to go again. Absolutely brilliant. I really like it it's really cool for sure be taking this on canoeing trips and stuff like that um, same the same striker, these guys are smashing it out. There is something I'm gonna show you at the end of the video about those, that red stuff. You just gotta keep tuned guys, um, because I've not seen it advertised anywhere and I don't even think they know. Or if they do, they should be shouting out about it more. There you go, lit again, easy. The Stealth, change the name gents. Other than that, mega. The Hive fire starter, um, hexagonal there, look. Do -do -do -do. So it's got loads of surface area, nice straight edge. Um, I've left the packaging on this because my one I've left in the truck and the truck is getting, um, having a new clutch put on it. So um, there you go, a little insert into my life. Um, but let's scrape that protective layer off. Let's scrape that blackness up. Look at that. Oh, it's like dragon breath. It is a beast. It's just 
I don't really know what to say about it. It's just, it's like the fire starter to rule them all. It's just great. The guys, they're smashing it out of Forest Fundamentals. Um, Elvis and his crew are just thinking, of, they just thought about everything. I mean, little clip. I bought all this again, by the way. Little clip, same fair rod. I mean, I don't know what else to say about it other than if you want to set fire to the world, get one of these. I love it. Can you tell? Now, the necklace. Start, let's start with the... I don't wear necklaces, I've already said, all right? It's a bit of a gimmick for me. I don't, you know, well, each to their own, you know? Each to their own. I don't like them, but, you know, go for your life. I'm not your dad. Um, at least I hope not. Magnetised clip, though. Again, you can just tell the thought process that's gone into this. Um, you've got a necklace on, magnetised, clip, done, nice. Um, can't strangle yourself. Then the striker is a different striker than the um, than obviously the, the other ones because it's a lot smaller. It's still got a burr on there. You can still flick off some sparks. I mean, it works. It's not good. that. I mean, this tiny little necklace works better than most full-size ferro rods, especially the stuff you get from eBay and some of the garbage that they sell on Amazon. I mean, it does do what it says on the tin. It is a ferro rod in a necklace. I mean, for that, you can't go wrong. Um, again, the bottle opener. Fair play, lads. I mean, I still wouldn't wear it, but I can see it's coming in handy. Lanyard on a knife or something like that. Yeah, now that's, that's, that's probably a good idea. Um, but you know, if you're into wearing necklaces with stuff like that and you feel like you need that sort of stuff around your neck, then they've definitely thought about it. So fair play. I was gonna let you into a little secret. Like I said, that red, the two red tips on this paracord is, um, is actually waxed paracord, um, waxed inner line. So if I take my knife, give it a cut, and pull it out, you see it's not just any normal paracord. It has this big, thick, red, waxy section to it that if you untwist, now I, I, the crazy thing is, is that it's not even on their marketing, it's not even on their advertising. It's just like something that they've put in that's so obvious to them that why wouldn't you have it, I guess. Get them a little fur rod and the striker. Now where we go? Look at that. Waxed tinder already in the paracord. And now I've lit the rest of it because obviously we know plastic, paracord, all that sort of jazz. Gents, you need to be shouting about that because that is mega. Forest Fundamentals then. Um, I'm well impressed. I've been using them for a good few months now. 12 quid with your fatwood and your striker, bargain. Uh, just get one, just do it, do it. 14.95 for your necklace, um, 14.95 for your hexagon, six inches of pure fiery joy, um, and then 20 quid for your waxed Forest Fundamentals striker thing down there. If you want one, there's a link below. Um, we get a small kickback, but hey, just get one. I don't care whether it's from me or from someone else. It's just, just get one guys. There are, then we'll not let you down. Till next time. Bye for now.